A man in a small town just northwest of Brookings is in need of a new liver after being diagnosed with an end-stage liver disease. Justin Sata from Bruce was only given five years to live. Well, that was eight years ago, but now he needs a transplant. On the night beat, Kevin Lance Carter Schmidt explains how the community is showing their support. 50-year-old Justin Sadoff owned his own excavation business for over 25 years. Due to my liver disease, the last few years, is, my health has really kind of declined and just had a, I was starting to struggle doing, you know, some of the physical work. And so I'd been thinking about it for three or four years, maybe trying to find something else. Justin opened Nina's Pizzeria at the beginning of this year, and the name comes from someone he's very close to. My seven-year-old daughter, I got one daughter, Nina is her name, and uh, she was, she's been my inspiration for pretty much everything. He was diagnosed with end-stage liver disease in 2015 and only given five years to live. If I really controlled my eating and ate, watch what I put in my body, that could maybe slow down the progression a little bit. And obviously that's helped. I've lost quite a bit of weight and, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going on eight years now. He says if it weren't for Nina, he would have given up long ago. She's my drive, my motivation, the reason I breathe every day. Justin is now on a waiting list at a hospital in Omaha. They said it could be two days, it could be two weeks, it could be two months. They just, you know, it just depends. If Justin has the procedure and all goes well, his doctors say he could live 30 to 35 more years. Which was great. That's more than I could ask for. A benefit will be held this weekend in Esteline for Justin, which was organized by a number of people, including his sister and sister-in-law. We love him, and um, we've obviously been waiting a long time for him to be able to have this transplant, and we know that the expense is, is great, even with, even with insurance. And uh, so we just wanted to do what we could for him. He's got Nina, and she is such a um, bright light in his life, and so I want him to be around for many years for her. I've never been an emotional guy, but it just cho chokes me up. It's unreal. You have no idea the, the care and the support until something like that happens to you. So it's been phenomenal. So grateful, so blessed. In Bruce, Carter Schmidt, Kelland News. The benefit is Sunday at the Esteline High School gym and will include live music, a silent auction, food and more. You can see a flyer with all of the details attached to this story on Kelland.com.